Hello everyone, and welcome back to Echoes of Mana. Alright, so, before we get into the Secret of Mana stuff, I noticed that our- wow, okay. That could be smoothed out, yeah. I noticed that our party members are all starting to fill these towns, so that's kind of nice. And also, um, remember when I was complaining in the first episode that I picked Purim? I don't actually feel bad about that, because we got two different Purims. So we got one with a set of uh, fists and undine, or undine, and then we've got boomerang and sylph. So that's pretty decent. Okay, so it looks like we can't do too much more until we unlock some more stuff, so let's get straight into that. Plus, I want to unlock events, damn it. Could at least do that off screen. The Lost Lackey. Ooh, Rabbites. Hey, you've got a memory gem on you, right? Equip it. I already did. I should have probably leveled up leveled it up a few more times actually, but oh well. This is very Undertale-esque. Very Deltarune. I'm gonna have to do Deltarune soon, man. Oh, new cutscene. Oh, nope. Oh, that music. I can't wait to do Secret of Mana on the channel. I put it off because of my old co host Hoff wanted to do it with me, but like. He's an unreliable hippie, man. <laughs> I mean, like, no offense if you're watching this, Hoff, but like, you know, one weekend you could be in a different state. Or country, I don't know. <laughs> yes, now, where are we this time? I see a lot of trees. Gaia's navel, perhaps? Ah, I've got this. This must be a forest. Yes, we've landed in a forest. Yeah! Did you hear that? I don't like the way that sound sounded. Which means it's time to hide. Good luck. Yeah, thanks for bail on me, dude. Make way! Oh, it's the Sprite. I always just named him Sprite. But he does have a name. Yeah, there it is, Papoy. Are you alright? Ow! Now where am I, and how did I end up here? Weird, I can't remember how I got here. But, I fell from the sky. Yeah, you know what? I bet the cannon man messed something up. The cannon man? You see, a man puts you in a cannon, and then boom, you're blasting off somewhere where you need to go. It's some, it's handy for sure, but the aim is, well, it ain't the best, so sometimes you kind of just end up somewhere else. And yeah, I don't see my bro and sis around, so I guess I need to go look for him. Good grief. Lackeys need to be with their boss at all times. Who do they think they are? Oi. Hey you with the funky hair, you can call me Papoy. And your name would be? <laughs> Okie dokie, today's your lucky day. I'm in need of a new lackey and you're top of the list. Lackey, eh? Huh? Eh, that doesn't sound... Well, it doesn't matter what you say, you're already hired. Uh. Okie dokie, follow me, lackey. Heavens to mana, we don't have time to be playing lackey. We're supposed to be looking for the mana sword. What are you dilly-dallying for? Not my fault if you get lost, lackey. Bah. They're right. Maybe it's best if we follow them until they find their friends, at least. Oh, man. <coughs> oh, yeah. Get wrecked. Hell yeah. Nope. Getting used to using that dodge mechanic. Oh yeah. Is there a down? Nope. But 
there is a timer. defeated. Well, it's easy now. I bet it's not going to be later. Oh yeah. Give me them rank ups. Oh, used to unlock a mana board for out mana board power. Used to unlock mana board panels for dark allies. Nice. So that's what they're for. So we need a bunch of dark ones for Thanatos. We need a bunch of Jin or Sylphid ones for one of the characters and Undyne for the other one. All right, off we go. I bet Bro and Sis are this way. That's what my gut is telling me, and it's always right. Stick close, Lackey. Come on, Lackey, put some spirit into it. Keep this up and you'll be stuck at low-level Lackey forever, you know. Just my luck, though. All my Lackeys have an attitude. You'd think they'd show their boss a little more respect. But don't worry, I'll whip you right into shape. Oh man, Sprite has a pretty bad story. Like, Papoy, I mean. I mean, like, it's not a bad story, it's a sad story, though. <laughs> It's funny, because this is the moment that I'm realizing that the hero from Legend of Mana is a girl. <laughs> so the character I'm not controlling that has the long blonde hair is uh, the one of the main characters from Legend of Mana. And I used to use them all the time, because they had long hair. And I thought they looked cooler. But I didn't realize they were a girl, so whatevs. That's cool. I'm glad that we've got them. Nope. I can't believe we're just rocking around with Thanatos. That's hilarious. I'm glad that you can get bad guy characters. I hope we get some of the marbles. Oh, we're getting some nice experience. Luminar. Nice. Cell. <laughs> no. Might try um, unlocking a couple though. We're probably going to unlock a bunch of plates, and then it'll tell us how to use them. So I won't go searching just yet. We're getting a nice amount of crystals for this. And as long as we keep ranking up, um... It seems like I can at least get a couple of episodes in a row before I'm going to have to leave it. Which is just... The worst. By the way, where are your friends? Or are you here alone? Um, I've got a sheepish sidekick. What? Like a stuffed animal that you can't sleep without. Hmm. Never fear bosses here. And as soon as I find my bro and sis, I'll introduce you to them. <coughs> so we'll, you'll help me look, look for them, won't you? Here's the deal. Bro has hair that's kinda... Kind of like the top of a pineapple, you know? All prickly and stuff. 
And sis, well, she's full on pink, head to toe. Pineapple boy and pink girl. What sort of gang is this? <laughs> well, we've already got Purim, and we kind of missed out on Randy, unfortunately. I kind of wish I grabbed him, actually, because... Damn. We might get a chance again soon, though. Sorry, Rabbites. I'm probably going to get a Rabbite tattooed one day. I've got uh, Lumina slash Wisp and Shade tattooed. Had to get Shade tattooed. Come on. I got that on my right shoulder. And away we go. Now, I can't say I'm really a big fan of the whole stage dynamic. I'm glad that they've tried to keep, like, a, an active battle system. Oh. Oh, it might be boss time. Um... Oh yeah, there we go. 20 hit combo. I am liking a more detailed look at the characters, but I am assuming I'm going to get a big look at that when I do the actual, uh, you know. And also, we got a pole arm leveled up, which means we can probably charge up our attack one time. Hmm. I might have to change around my button layout, to be honest. I can at least change between characters and do all of the attacks, but I just might need to change which buttons they are. <coughs> Pink and spotted. Not over here either. There you are, sis. Little bit. I finally found you. Where were you anyway? Oh, the music. Oh, I'm loving the remix music, man. Wait, Randy's not with you? And who is this? This is Lackey number three. Lackey. Oh boy, you went and forced somebody else to follow you around, didn't you? Quilto, was it? My name is Prem. Whoops, I was called in a Purim before. <laughs> you seem like the laid-back type, but Papoy is being a bother, so just go ahead and say, say so. <laughs> okay, Lackeys, you play nice now, you hear? So, the only thing missing now is Bro. Where do you suppose he is? About that. I think we're pretty close to Potos Village. Wait, THE Potos Village? Didn't they kick Randy out when he was a boy for pulling the Mana Sword free? If he landed over there, we're talking worst case scenario here. You said it. I can't imagine he'd feel too great about seeing that place again. We'd better hurry. You coming along? You don't have to if you don't want to, you know. You're searching for the mana sword? Talk about luck, we're heading in the same direction. Randy is the one who has it, after all. <coughs> Wait, you're not some kind of bad guy who's looking for the mana sword so you can... Eh, you don't look the type. Yes, I am bad. I'm trying to save the world. That doesn't sound likely either. Are you being serious? You and Randy do share the same kind of dopey look in your eyes, so maybe you're telling the truth after all. Anyway, it sounds like we're going in together. Let's find Randy. <laughs> Papoy with his goof-ass look. Or her goof-ass look, I'm not even sure. 
Yeah, that looks like following these folks around is starting to pay off. My sheep's intuition is telling me destiny is leading me the way. Now let's hurry and find this brandy they speak of. Man, halfway through the third episode, I'm kind of into it, you know? I mean, it's not a mana game that I would want as a dedicated game, and it's the same sort of gotcha, charge too much money, and time gate content crap, but like aside from that, <laughs> it's a pretty decent mobile game. And I do love the mana series. And to be honest, it needs more props. I wish they, well not they, but I wish Capcom um, actually released the Breath of Fire one. Yes. Over in uh, um, English territories. Poto's village is this way, follow me. Huh? Sis, I'm the boss here, I give the orders. Do you even know where we are right now? <laughs> Wait, actually I've never come this far either. And it almost feels like we're going the opposite way on the path Randy would use to go to the village. Ugh, the cannon man's supposed to save us time, not waste it. Hmm. Oh. Let's try some of this auto battle. Uh, full auto. It'll be cool if we can speed it up later. Although, that's the same thing with like most mobile games. You set it to auto and you just kick back and you're not even really playing it, but... Maybe in the beginning. Like, just until we start leveling up a bit more can just leave it this way. It'd be nice if it would automatically collect our chests and stuff. I'm definitely gonna properly fight bosses and stuff though. We are actually starting to lose a little bit of health, so it's probably almost time to start leveling. I'll see if I can push through chapter 2 first. Nice. Oh yeah. Sherry and co-op battles. Interesting. <coughs> Sweet. Just as long as we're getting towards another ten pool. I would like to get one in in this episode, that would be ideal. The monsters just keep coming, don't they? Everyone okay? Need a break? Ready for duty, boss. <laughs> Looks like someone knows who the real boss is around here. <laughs> yeah, and it's me! No usurping, okay? Start an order. Yep. I just want to see if it automatically gets chests. It seems to be pretty decent AI. If it could get chests as well. Oh, I think those chests are the ones you just get at the end of battle anyway. Nevertheless. When there's a stage that has chests, I'll definitely have to have a look at it. I don't want to have the game play itself, but if it's just 
you know, repetitive levels like this, where we're fighting enemies we've fought a hundred times already. Like, whatever, you know. But if it's a boss... Oh, we got Niccolo out. Oh, they're effectively switching. Or maybe that character died? Look at him. He's a big boy with a big axe. And a big ass. Nice. Heck yeah. Nice. Five, damn. Okay. Before we go any further, I want to see if we've done any more missions. I do want to get through chapter 2 though before we continue on. So what have we got? I know we've got a couple of things, so maybe we could do some of the character boards if we've unlocked them. Hey, I'll take it. There we go. Nice, 200, sweet. Um, alright, so we need to do mana boards. Must be unlocked to play. So we haven't unlocked mana boards yet? I'm glad we came in there though, because we got a fair bit more um, gems. Um... Allies, perhaps. So we got six. So everybody gets two each, but this is a main character, so. Sweet. Um, who's in our party? Thanatos is in our party. is pretty badass. Um, alright. <laughs> um, and you. Serafina, was it? It's a cool name. Um, one. At least the front row are all level 18. Um, the back row... We've got Prim. Sixteen. 
Niccolo can be 16. And then those last four can go on our Aldo equivalent. <laughs> Quilto. I wish I could change his name, because I have regrets. I should have just named it Quilto, but it just seemed like such a silly name. Oh, he's got his name right there. Never mind. Um, you. There we go, he's at least level 14. Alright, we've clearly not unlocked the board thing yet, so let's go and do that right now. And then that way, we can unlock our full board. Oh, we've unlocked something. Pretty determined to get in another 10 pool this episode. And we're only 300 off, so hopefully by the time we finish up these quests, we should have enough. It's really looking like these last few episodes are hitting an average of like 40 minutes, so... That's a bit over, but you know. It helps having, um... Having... our characters on um, auto battle, because it just goes through the fights a lot quicker, and like, yeah, I want to actually do the boss fights myself, but like, the random garbage fights, whatever. At least in the beginning portion of the game. Oh, yeah. I think after this as well, I'm gonna go and try and do another 30, 40 floors in uh, the Ancient Cave in Lucia 3 as well. Hopefully I've got that ready by the time this episode goes up. But yeah, 200 floors, man. Oof. I'm doing like 20, 30 a day. Oh yeah, wrecked. Oh yeah. Shade for the win, twenty eight hits. Sweet. Nice. Hmm. I wonder how much more there is in this chapter. And I wonder if the next chapter is going to go straight to Trials of Mana. I would say the likelihood of that is pretty high. A pleasant place called Potos. Oh, we are totally fighting that Mantis Ant. That is definitely going to happen, as if it wouldn't. Ah, so this is Potos Village. Doesn't look too scary to me. Doesn't look like Randy's here either. Uh. Yeah, if they'd have found him, the villagers would be running around screaming about curses and calamity right now. He told us once about the waterfall on the other side of the village, remember? The place where he freed the mana sword. Ah, ah good thinking, Lackey. Let's check it out. A place with a connection to Bro might just lead us to him too. Oh my god, they did art for them. Hey you, outsiders, you can't go through here. It's the villager's decree. I'm gonna tell the Elder. Hey, I remember playing Secret of Mana as a kid, and like, I was staring at pixels then. I'm staring at characters now, and I just really need you two to know. 
fuck you both. <laughs> hey, what? What we do is none of your business. Now, out of the way, brats. Damn right. Who are you calling a brat, brat? You, you freaking doofy douche. Yeah, you're the only brat around here, bratty brat brat. Man, you are both begging for the wedge. The wedgie of a century. What did you say, you booger-eating pea-brained little... <laughs> Papoy, that's enough. We don't need to stoop to their level. They're just kids. Don't take everything they say so seriously. Said the big brat with the little baby brat. Good one, Elliot. Look at their dumb brat faces. Bratty brat and biggie brat just sitting in a tree. B-R-A-T-I-N-G. <laughs> Say brat one more time, you little punks. Nobody calls me a brat. Guess this big brat is going to have to teach the little brats a lesson, huh? Uh, sorry. We're real sorry. Take him to pound town. Let's not be rushed now. You're right, I can't let these kids get in my head. But just in case, let's go before I give them a beating of a lifetime. You saw nothing, got it? Yes, ma'am. Alright, so, what do we do? Let's get... There's no getting through there to reach the waterfall. But we still think Bro might be there, right? I mean, we didn't see him coming up the road on the way here. <coughs> Ooh, it's Saren. <laughs> Zoinks! Is that a g g ghost? Kind of feels like it wants us to follow it. Yeah, let's follow it. Seriously, wait up, sis. Pretty sure his name is Saren. It's been a frickin' decade or so. Probably a bit more, actually. Jeez. It's about 200 off. Twilbull Tower is a high-level quest where a boss awaits you every ten floors. Twilbull. Huh? The ghost up and disappeared. Where did it spook off to? You're right, I don't see it anywhere, stupid ghost. Serves us right for blindly following it, though. But it looks like we're probably on the side of the village, where that path would have led. So I guess our ghost pal was guiding us after all. Which means Bro just has to be around here somewhere. Uh-oh. Eep. Well, would you look at that? It's the Booger Brats. Why are they all the way over here? That is weird. Add to the list of weird stuff that's happened since we got here. Another echo anomaly, perhaps. Like the events in a timeline getting all jumbled up. And that's all the commentary I've got. Until next time. Something's got them all riled up. I wonder what it is. B -b -b big trouble! Randy fell down the waterfall! What? Randy fell? Oh no! I knew that moron would get himself into trouble if we uh, left him alone long enough. We gotta go over there now. Popoy, shade, let's go. Go get him! Uh, we're gonna go. You're gonna have to cut through the grass. Yep, I'm aware of mana games. <laughs> I'll play this one manually. Oh, this Hagen's look terrible. Had about enough of your crap, buddy. All 
Alright. Oh, this is a good a good time to test whether or not it goes for the chests. I do like that, um, despite the fact they gave us some high-level characters and we've leveled up a bit, that the game isn't just super easy rollover. Okay, uh, it doesn't automatically get the chess. Echo Sprout. got no ranged, do we? Dark force. Oh, no. How do I switch? I don't think I can get that, unfortunately. Oh well. Oh, I can switch via the subs. Interesting. Oh man, I'm going to have to change my setups again. Off you go. Jeez, Nicola, wrecking house. Alright, um, we're going up. Wait, shouldn't we do this? There we go. Uh, we don't want to be you, buddy, sorry. Okay, we don't have the right weapons. Good to know that uh, they lock stuff like that behind weapons. Oh yeah. B. Oh yeah. Let's keep leveling up, that means we can get more episodes in. Let's see now, you should just be about used to questing in your journey, so it's about time to speed up with mana boards. Ooh, home, finally. Second now. Upgrade mana boards here to boost your ally stats. All you need to do is all you need is the upgrade materials. Okay. Okay, sweet. Nice. Boosting stats makes a difference, and the difference is sheer. Next time you need spirit coins for upgrades, you can get them by playing training dungeons. Sweet! I think we gotta use three, so two more. These are the training dungeons. 
there is a certain elemental coin you need, you can play the dungeon where it should drop. Okay, please don't make me do that. Because we've still got to do the final boss of that area before we can round out the episode. But... I will upgrade some characters, so... Sylph! We would have some Sylph coins. Okay, can't do that. Um, Thanatos, you would be packing. <laughs> I love him. <laughs> that voice is epic. Um, alright, so... Seraphina. This is good as well, I'm learning more character names. Oh, we don't have any for you. What about Prim? Prim's on Dean. We've used all the Dean. What about Niccolo? There we go. Damn, he's actually got some pretty damn good stats. Alright, but that should be enough. That should be three boards. And that means that we'll get our ten pull, hopefully. Hopefully. Forty. There we go, 2700, there's our ten pull. Oh yeah. Five line bingo. Bingo board complete. Oh yeah. Nice. 400. New bingo missions. Sweet. Another 200. Sweet! All right, good. But we will do the ten pull last because we are nearly at the end of that mission. Damn it! We're about to go meet Randy. Ooh. I will take the treasure though. Collect. That'll be for some in between um, episode fighting. Okay, chapter two, the boss battle, Mantis Ant, what did I say, what did I say? Let's do this. And then we get a ten pull to round out the episode, that's actually quite good. I was going to do a five episode sitting, but I feel like three is kind of nice, because these episodes have been a bit longer, because... That way I get a bit of time in to do some more Lufia 3, and I'm really all about um, trying to catch up on some series because, like, too much health and life got in the way, man. Like, I've got some stuff to catch up, and a lot of stuff that I wanted to do. Um, we ain't fighting the Mantis Ant yet, so you guys can stay on full auto. It looks like you can actually go into the characters and change their AI as well, which is good. Oh, Thanatos. You're cute. Stage 2. Why did it go all close up like that? That's the mana sword. That's the mana sword in the background right there. Get rickety wrecked. Oh, it's boss time.
We've made it to the bottom of the waterfall, but I don't see Randy anywhere. <sighs> Such a long way to fall. Do you think he survived? The scenery seems a bit strange. Hello? Anyone home? Stop staring into the void and look around for my bro. Whoa! Earthquake! I'm really enjoying the soundtrack. Yikes, what is that thing? Ugh, we don't have time for this now. But if we gotta fight, then we'll fight. Look alive, we gotta take this thing down. Oh, we're gonna be looking alive alright. Boss battle time. I always did love the Mantisan. Oh, he is. Oh, wait, he's weak against me. I wanted to get that in a damn combo. Yeah, really, I'm gonna have to set up my buttons again. Got him! All foes defeated. Sweet! Oh, we didn't get an S rank. Oh well, I can always come back and do it. Man, another frickin' long episode, huh? Aw oh, man. Blade beneath the waterfall. At least we can round out the chapter. <sighs> Woof, glad that's over. <laughs> hey, look over there. You see what I see sticking out of that rock? Isn't that the Mana Sword? <sighs> but why is it here? I thought Bro already pulled it out. <gasps> hey Bro! Thank goodness you're safe. Don't make me worry like that again. Randy? Hello? Anyone home? Randy, blink twice if you can hear me. I don't think he hit on his head. You don't think he hit his head on the way down, did you? Randy, take the sword. Randy. I entrust the sword to you, my son. <laughs> huh? Why am I... 
Randy. Prim, Papoy. Alright, now you speak. What's up with the silent treatment? Silent? I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, who is this? Alright, our friend here wants to take a look at your mana sword. Sure, but why? The mana goddess needs it. Hey, that's Randy's prized possession we're talking about. We're gonna need a full explanation explanation before he hands it over. Oh, but I already... uh, yeah. Wahaha! <laughs> Never doubt a sheep's intuition. We did it! Got us! We found the mana sword! And now it's back! What? Then that must mean... Looks like the mana sword we need isn't in this echo after all. But just seeing a real mana sword is just a big deal. Just take a look around. The sheer brilliance of the mana sword is perfectly righted and echo riddled with chaos. A wonder indeed. It's not hard to see how the mana sword is the answer to saving our realm. <laughs> By goddess, my wool's just itching to get our mana sword shade. Don't you agree? <laughs> and you are? <laughs> Oops, I, uh, uh. Pay no attention to the floating sheep. Not so fast. Ah, be gentle! <laughs> what a weird and fluffy little thing. So are you like a talking monster or a ghost? One thing I can say for sure, though, is you're definitely not a sheep. Okay, but how's it moving? Is there something inside it? Stop that right this instant. Quit pulling at me. My body is goddess made. A super rare item. I'm not fully sure I get what's going on here, but... You're from another world, and you came here looking for the mana sword. Is that the gist of it? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Well, if you say it's that simple, then I guess it must be. This sword I pulled from the stone, basically by accident. If it's what you need to save our world, then you deserve to have it more than I do. It's why you came here. It's too important to keep to myself. Demo. At least, that's what I thought at first, but it looks like this mana sword has chosen me. Even if it was by accident, I must continue to carry it. <laughs> After all we've been through, why am I suddenly so nervous? This Echo's a bust, let's head back. Come on now. Hey, the fluff monster's trying to get away. Heading back, eh? Where exactly to? Whoa. I see. Off to the next world, is it? Sounds amazing. I know the road won't be easy, but just remember to never give up, okay? Mm. And while we're making promises, I swear on this man mana sword that I won't give up either. Oh. See you later, Lackey. Be sure to come and visit your boss when you get lonely. And when you finally get your hands on your very own mana sword, come back and show it to us. We'll be waiting. Yeah. Satisfaction. <clears throat> and we should just get the episode in in just under an hour. Damn, a long one. We're only three episodes in and we're already up to a long one. I really just had to finish this frickin' chapter in this episode, didn't I? Yep. That's the answer. Oh yeah, he who bears the sword. 
Nice. Ooh, extra quests, but not. We got a 10 pull with that name on it. Oh, more unlockables. to another temple, but we'll do one this episode, and I'll try to save the other one for next episode. Ooh, we're real close. I don't know, I might do two more episodes, but I'll take a break first. Um, alright, so harvest, yeah, I think it's harvest. It is, it is harvest. Alright, let's do it. Touching it. There is no way. Oh, purple. Damn, that's pretty. I wear my mom's ribbon with pride. Oh, her again. Reese. Well, I guess we can upgrade her, but I would have liked Jiren. Oh yeah, a boy with the bow, nice. Oh, a three-star Dark Lord. Oh man, I'm gonna have to change that team up. Oh, and we can level up Mikkel. Oh wait, that's a different Nicolo. Cool though. Hell yeah, dude, we got a freaking three-star Dark Lord. Nice. Nice. Uh, not now, dude. Go away. Still playing the game. Alright. Well, I think that's a really long episode, and I better call it before it gets over an hour, so I am going to call that an episode there. If you guys like what you saw, like, comment, and subscribe. Ring that notification bell to stay up to date with episodes, and until the next episode of Echoes of Mana. I've been Shade Orion, you've been watching Dude Go Back. Thanks for watching everyone.